Greetings, it's that time of the month when we gather with others to bring you a collaborative view and opinion on a random subject. This month's subject is that of the health benefits that are derived by motorhoming or caravanning. There are a number of other people involved and we hope that you will watch their videos too. There'll be a playlist at the end of this one. Now working out the health benefits, given how much cake, wine, beer and all other sorts of uh, and gin, and gin <laughs> that we consume during our travels might be a bit of a challenge, but this is our take on it. Let's start with the fact that accessing the great outdoors alone is a health benefit. The wide open spaces have long been a sanctuary for those wanting to de-stress and relax. And this can be mountains, it can be valleys, it can be shorelines, forests, and in even some cases, the crafted beautiful campsites that exist around this country and in Europe. It doesn't matter where it is really, the motorhome can take you to find some solace locally and other travels over hundreds of miles equally so. The alternative of, of being at home and shouting at the television is ghastly to us, unless of course it's shouting at Manchester United, but with all of our crosses to bear. Motorhome life is also an enabler. It enables you to access your creative side. Perhaps you like to draw, to paint, to photograph, to listen to music or just to read. It creates the space and time and access to enable you to do this. Probably more easier if you've not got children with you. But even then, what a better way for children to spend their upbringing than seeing the world through a screen. The provision of time enables us to consider who we are and where we've come from and our collective history. The things we have in common these greatly outnumber those that are in difference, and those differences seem much more in focus when we live small. Motorhoming allows us to live big. Then of course there is exercise. Whether you like running, walking, biking, or just bimbling along and exploring, walking the dog perhaps, it matters not. Most sources agree this is a great way to benefit your health, both mentally and physically. And motorhoming and caravanning and camping enable you to do that. One of the things that we think's improved uh, our health and knowledge is our ability to look at history and culture. We've explored the differences between the Basques, the Catalans and the Galatians, when from a distance they all look as if they're the same people, and clearly they're not. But you have to get up close and personal and meet them. And meeting people and meeting other communities and increasing understanding for us is a great way to improve your health, your understanding of the world, and feel more confident about where you fit. And whatever your interests are in history, regardless of whether it's Roman, pre-Roman, Anglo-Saxon, Norman, Tudor, or more contemporary history, travel enables you to explore our past in a way that brings it close and home and meaningful. At the end of the day, the definition of Zen is a state of calm attentiveness in which one's actions are guided by intuition rather than by conscious effort the best form of healing for the mind and the body, according to many sources. We hope you like our take on this subject. We've been caravanning our motorhome in for over 20 years and it's definitely the best thing we've ever done. Absolutely. And if you like what you've said, please, uh, what we've said, please subscribe to the channel and like it, it helps us. And also we, we can, uh, you can get in touch with us on Facebook and Instagram. Uh, the links will be below. And thank you for that. Please watch the other videos, they are coming up now. And on that subject, Martin out. Helen out.